When I'm doing hair, I like to look at someone and just think, right. When I'm doing hair, I like to look at someone and just think, right, how can we make them look great and feel great? Well, clothes are something we wear every day of our lives. It's like a second skin. If you feel good in that skin, you can do anything you want in life. Teaching them how to use the right tools, how to choose the right makeup and make themselves look and feel amazing. I don't think I've ever come across three more stylish I know. men in my life. They are stylish. You're stylish, though. Not well. as stylish as them. Uh, and they're currently <laughs> just outside on the South Bank pretending to be doing a demonstration. There they are. Now, watching them is poor, unsuspecting Tina Freeman. Now, Tina's daughter, Claire, has nominated her for a surprise makeover because she says her mum's dress sense has become so bad, not only does she wear socks with sandals, you do that, uh, her socks have holes in them as well. So, let's hand over to stylist Darren as he's about to give Tina the surprise of her life. <laughs> One second. This will help you, actually. Fabulous. The whole thing with this sort of loose updo, you have to get the foundations right and you have to get the hair off the face. So I'm loosely, loosely brushing this. And you can see there's a lot of straight... Mark, I'm just going to stop you there. I'm just going to stop you there very quickly. Guys, we've got a little confession to make, right? We are here to do a makeover today. <laughs> that much is true. We're not making over this model, because, well, she doesn't need it, does she? We are, in fact, making over one of you lot in this very crowd. Yes. One of you has been nominated for a surprise makeover, a complete image overhaul. And I'm going to reveal to you now who that person is. Today, the Style Squad are tackling you, Tina Freeman. Woo! Yes. Come with me. Yes! <laughs> come Are you surprised? Yes! Come, come on, with me, come with me, no, come with me. Ready. Yes! <laughs> oh my god! Yes! Hello, Tina. We are ready, my darling. We are ready. And have a look at the. We are going to make you over. We've got about 60 minutes. We are going to give you a complete image overhaul. And uh, we are going to do your hair, we are going to do your makeup, we are going to do your clothes. And in studio, if you just have a look there, is Jamie Thiexton and Emma Bunton. Say hello. Hi, Tina. Hello. Hi, Tina. Hello. I'm Emma Bunton. This is Jamie Thiexton. We're presenting ITV's This Morning Summer today. Do you know who nominated you? Not a clue. Well, it was your daughter, Claire. Claire, come on. Oh, Where is Claire? Over today? Um, she works tirelessly at work, to be honest, and she, she doesn't have any time for herself. She's um, she's just she gives everything to everybody else and, and, and never gets anything back. And, and I think she just really deserves to have this done for her. Oh, now, listen, nice. Claire, I understand you had to tell a few white lies to get Mum here today. <laughs> just yeah. a few. Yeah, um, <laughs> yeah, it's been quite difficult, but uh, I, I've basically just told her that I'm taking her away for the weekend yeah. and we're going to have a girly day, do a bit of shopping. Shopping, which she absolutely hates. Yeah. So it's, it's taken a lot for me to persuade her, but yeah, she, she's here, so. <laughs> Tina, Tina, how are you feeling right now? Scared. <laughs> Don't be Ready scared. for a makeover? Don't be scared. You've only got 60 minutes to do a miracle. <laughs> <laughs> you are in good hands, let me tell you. You are in good hands. You're going to have a great time. So, Thank Style you. Squad, tell us, what do you got in mind for Tina today? Well, straight away, I'm thinking, Jamie, I want to bring some some structure to this look. It's very floaty, it's very relaxed, which I'm sure is very comfortable, but I want to give you comfort and structure. And show off those legs. Makeup? I think Tina has been hiding far too long. So you can see she's hiding behind the glasses. She's got a sneaky little tattoo here, so she's not a good girl. I want to bring out the bad girl. <laughs> I'm a good girl. Don't kill me, Tina. <laughs> I think with Tina's hair, I think we've, we've got, you know, let's get it looking really shiny, let's, let's get some volume in there, and just let's have it feeling great and looking great. Uh, anything you want to say? <laughs> I'm speechless. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be fabulous. We look after you, Thank we look you. after you. Right, well, I think we shall get cracking. We will uh, talk to you guys later. Darren, Mark and Mikey are now an hour into their makeover, so let's check in with them, see how the transformation's going. Let's start with our super stylist, Darren. Darren, where are you up to? How's it going? Well, do you know what? It's gone really well. It's been slightly manic, but in a good way. Now, I've actually been trying to narrow down a couple of frocks 
which are gonna make Tina look absolutely rocking. It is summer, obviously, so we're thinking lots of color, perhaps a floral, perhaps a bold block of color. We've yet to decide. But do you know what, with Tina, she has actually gained a little bit of weight over the past couple of years. And do you know what, it's a problem that so many women actually have, and it's all about dressing for your shape. So with Tina, what we're thinking at the moment is maybe a little bit of a, a fit and flare. So something that cinches in her waist and kicks out over her legs. And then for makeup, well, Mikey, what are we going to do? So Tina is a child of the 70s, so we're trying to bring her into the 21st century a little bit. Um, enhancing the skin, she's never done her eyebrows, she's never worn eye makeup. My take-home tip in this kind of weather is to wear a primer. A primer is translucent on the skin, holds the makeup in place, the makeup will look flawless and obviously last in this heat, so that's my top tip. OK, well, we've been having some fun back here. We've transformed Tina's colour and it's hiding under the towel here. I've also started to cut a different shape into Tina's hair, something that's going to be really versatile for her at home, but something that's going to look great this morning. And my take-home tip is when you're choosing the right colour, Try and talk to the person that cuts your hair. Try and get as much feedback as you can. If not, talk to your friends. Back to you in the studio. And we'll be unveiling Tina's brand new look at right. uh, the end of today's show. You, so so um, it was just under two hours ago we surprised Tina Freeman by revealing live on air that her daughter Claire had nominated her for a makeover by our Style Squad. Stylist Darren, hairdresser Mark and makeup man Mikey have been working their magic. But before we see the finished look, uh, let's chat about the challenges that they've faced and the style choices uh, they made. Let's uh, start with you, Darren. Do you know what I have to say before we go any further? Tina has been an absolute sweetheart. Aww. I said to her at the beginning, just relax and enjoy it, and that is what she's done. Okay. And she just, well, I think she looks amazing. But the big challenge with Tina was, I guess like a lot of women, at different stages in life, your shape changes. And she gained a bit of weight, and it was around the tummy area. Again, you know, everyone has that problem. Happens to us all. Yes. Been, listen, it does. <laughs> C'est la vie. So it was really about bringing out the best in her shape. So kind of looking at how we could cut into her, her décolletage and kind of make that look longer. She's great legs on her. I said this all the way it. along. Showing off the legs and like giving her a waist. Because like we did not see a waist earlier on. And then we accessorized and we kind of kept it quite simple. I'm not going to tell you the color of the clutch yeah. that we gave um, Tina. But you know, at this time of year, everyone's got weddings, garden parties, whatnot. You need somewhere to put your little bits and bobs. You do. So absolutely. my top take home tip is to get yourself a good clutch. That can be a nude, which is like a neutral, we'll go with anything, or it can be any colour that you desire. And we've actually tracked down 10 of the hottest on the high street right now. If you ever want a new clutch, you just let me know. I love a clutch. Okay, you're going to buy me one? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, Mark, can you tell us a bit about what you've done with the hair? We've had a great time with Tina backstage. We've changed the cut and the colour. I'm not going to reveal which colour we've gone, but it works for summer. She looks amazing. I've also, just for a bit of fun, um, you saw on the tip earlier, we've, we've yeah. used this uh, hair chalk. You know, it just <gasps> adds a little bit of colour. Um, it's instant highlights. You can do it at home. Yeah. It's so, so easy. Wow. Looks and great. You'll it's see like in the reveal the gives colour. how good Perfect. Tina looks. She's impressed. Okay, looking forward to that. And uh, uh, Mikey, what about the makeup? Well, apparently I'm going home with Tina. I didn't know that about <laughs> it. Um, I think she's a child of the 70s. Amazing. So there was blue mascara, there was blue eyeshadow. Um, so I've had a blank canvas. She is a fabulous woman. So we've just enhanced everything. She does look 20 years younger. We said about the brow. Yes. She looks amazing. The we brow tip, eyebrow. I would say, you can see on the screen probably, is the three points to things. So tip of the nose, just past the iris, and then extend out to the corner of the face. Add in the definition, blending it through. I've also set it in place with a wax. And for the first time ever, we gave Tina a little bit of a tweeze. So she's been untouched until now. You, it, it's quite surprising how much an eyebrow yeah, just like, lifts the it's whole face. It's literally like face. a facelift. Yeah, absolutely. Good. Okay, Exciting. well, this is Claire. So, Claire. Claire. <laughs> Are you excited? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just, I don't know what she's going to look like. We have no idea. 
ways. So it, you, you did ask for your mummy to get a makeover, and uh, she has. So we're very yeah, excited about seeing her. Let's, let's take a look uh, at Tina. Let's remind ourselves what Tina looked like before. Yes. So there's Tina there she when she arrived uh, this morning. And are we ready? Are we ready are to we see ready? Tina? Yes. Are, we ready? Yeah. are you ready oh, to God. see Mum? <laughs> OK. And this <sighs> is what she looks like now. <gasps> Tina, here Tina. she comes. Oh. <laughs> So just oh, let's, let's, my just, goodness. let's just talk about so some of the, the outfit and the clutch. Tell us a little bit more about that. So this, yeah, this, I mean, frock, it's kind of got a 50s vibe to it. It's obviously got a nice floral there. It actually has a hint of a metallic in there as well, so it keeps it very current. And just the shape, you can see, it just hugs Tina in all the right places. It defines her bust. It gives her a beautiful waist that we didn't see earlier on. And then we can see her legs. Yeah. And can I just say as well, Tina was so excited when she said, three men, brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Tina, you look fabulous. Thank you feel you. good? I feel amazing. I feel like a diva. You do. You look amazing. And Claire, what do you think of your mum? I, 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 I can't, oh. I can't even speak. Do I speak. look pretty? Absolutely oh. stunning. Thank you. Stunning. Thank you, guys. You're welcome. So, Thank you. so, do you think her dresses were really that bad before? I mean, she looked gorgeous when she arrived, but obviously this really suits her, doesn't it? Yeah, but you didn't see the holy shoes, oh. <laughs> the jeans that show her ankles. We yeah, didn't it's see a massive, that. massive I think we might need another little twirl. Doesn't she look amazing? And whilst yeah. we do that, I think. I, I tell you what, <laughs> the hair, oh the gosh. hair looks fantastic. That's been, for me, is the biggest difference. Well, Tina had really good hair to start with. She had really nice natural curls. And what I wanted to do was just make her face look really oval, create this kind of shape, lift it with a bit of volume. Bit of a statement fringe and just add a really nice shiny colour. Tina, if I just get you to look yeah, at that, let's just look, let's just look, into let's this just talk so about we can the. See you. Let's just talk a little bit about the makeup as well because she looks fantastic. The I makeup think as is brilliant. You can see it? now, it's not masking, it's very natural, it's enhanced what she has. But I will say, Tina's got the most amazing lips, which we can now see. The oh, eyebrows, yeah. which were never touched. She's pouting she, for you there. I know, she's been pouting all day. <laughs> and I have sneaked a little bit of a lash in there just to open up the eye. You know, because she's a little bit flirty, so again, she's fluttering those lashes. Absolutely. And Tina, I'm just going to bring you in here a sec, darling. So come here, Claire. Come in, Tina. Come with me, Mum. Come on, come back. Come here. <laughs> come here. So listen, what what message have you got for your daughter? Oh, I'm so proud of her, and I'm so amazed, and she's just a, an incredible young woman, and I love her to pieces. Oh, thank, you. So thank, thank you. Lovely. Thank so you. So listen, we're, we're all saying how wonderful you look, but you actually haven't seen yourself yet. So I think maybe we should go and check out over here. We've got a lovely okay, mirror for you. Come and have a look. Thank you, Gunnar. It's a you good ready? surprise. Are you ready, Tina? <laughs> here we go. <laughs> wow. you know. How about that? Check it your ass, do a grill. You look absolutely beautiful. Wonderful. Oh. How amazing is that? Well done. So proud. Thank Our style is too. How are you, nice how are you feeling? This is wonderful. I never knew I could look like this. Lovely. Well, you do. You look fantastic. You. And listen, we know that uh, you are a, a big fan of Queen, so we've got two tickets for you oh. to go and see We Will Rock You at the Dominion Theatre. So oh, have fun. Thank you. Thank you. All dressed oh. up and somewhere thank to go. You. Thank Pleasure. you. Pleasure. And so what message have you got to our style squad? What if you get a uh, little message for them before we go? I just want to take them all home. They're all coming with me. I'd love to do that. Wouldn't that yes. be nice, having yes. a stylist? Thank you. You're thank you. Aren't yeah. brilliant? I'm so happy that you're happy. That's the job done. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Amazing. Thank you. Yeah. And how's it, so how's it been your day? How would you describe your day? Can you um, sum it up? From incredible. Incredible. Just stunned. I'm just can't take it all in at the moment. <laughs> and so now as you're going forward, are you going to be doing keeping your hair like that? And... Yes. I'm going to make a real effort now. Yeah, Claire yes. will help you, I'm sure, yes, anyway. definitely make a real effort. <laughs> I'll make it. Yes. Brilliant. Brilliant. Yeah. Fantastic. Amazing. Well, listen, thank you so much. Thank You've been you such so a great much. sport. You thank you. You're a lovely daughter now. Thank you. Oh, wow. What an amazing transformation. This I know. Brilliant.